Well, you probably recognize her as Sloan from Entourage. But besides being an actress, she's an environmentalist, a philanthropist, and you're from Toronto. <laughs> Let's welcome Emmanuel Shriki here. And uh, you actually went to high school in Unionville. That's right. You yeah. did. So when you mm -hmm. come back here, home to Toronto, what are your mm -hmm. favorite places to uh, visit? Well, when I'm not racing around, I mean, I love to get together with my friends and go to dinner and, you know, in Little Italy oh, and yes. go out. Like, mm -hmm. we have, like, the best dancing and music here of any city, hands really? down. Oh, yeah. Anywhere. Hands down. Nice. Yeah, we have a great music scene here in town. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. So you did play Sloan on Entourage, and now the, the series is actually coming to the big screen. That's pretty exciting. I mean, hopefully. Mm -hmm. it's It's been greenlit, so yeah. it's there, and there's a script, um, but we're still waiting for the official... This is a start date. Well, here could be a hint because creator Doug uh, Ellen recently posted this picture on, on Instagram. Here showing the final draft of the movie script and right. writing, my work here is done. We are so excited. So that must mean Listen, something, Listen, I'm right? excited. <laughs> I'm excited too. Are you going to start filming soon? Do you I, know? I, or? You know what? I don't know definitively. Would I you tell really, me if you knew? I would. You would. Are you kidding? Holy, I would tell you absolutely. <laughs> we have so many fans on City of Entourage. Oh, you know really? That. Yeah. That's so nice. I no idea we're here. It's yeah. so nice. I'm so, so happy. give us an insight. Nothing. I, I, I honestly, I don't know. Like, I, I, I'm hoping, my fingers are crossed, that we go in September, hopefully. Yeah. Um, did you feel like one of the boys on the set? I did. You did? I did. I mean, they were like my brothers, you know? Yeah. We worked together for six years. I was on the show for six years. Mm -hmm. They worked together for eight. Um, they are. I mean, they're still my boys. Like, Jerry <laughs> and Kevin, we're really, really good friends. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know what? We've been uh, watching you on the red carpet. You look flawless oh, on there. Uh, you're fine. beautiful. Do you have some beauty Thank secrets you. that uh, you want to share with us? Well, I do have a few I'd like to share. I'm I'm uh, I'm really proud to say that I'm the face of Mineral Fusion, mm -hmm. which is um, an all organic, beautiful hair care, skin care, cosmetic line, um, totally environmental. You know, paraben free, sulfate free. Mm -hmm. um, and I, I'm just super conscious about what I put on my skin and in my body, and um, it's As a many wonderful. Are. Yeah, and it's growing more mm -hmm. and more, and it makes me really happy. And I'm hoping that Mineral Fusion will become, you know, mainstream. We're coming. We're getting, we're in Canada, but it's going to be in Loblaws, which is huge, mm -hmm. um, and in Whole Foods and London Drugs. So I'm really excited about it. Are there two must-haves that should be in every woman's purse? Yes. Some that should be my wife's purse that I yes. don't know about. Yeah. You want to know? Yeah. Can I look in your purse? I mean, guys aren't you really take supposed a little, to look in. You want to uh, take a little gander? Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, black eyeliner, mm -hmm. mineral fusion. I mean, look at I can't live without it. <laughs> yeah. And this is my favorite. Um, your wife will love this. A uh -huh. hydration mist. Okay. It's amazing. Like, if you're tired, you're just feeling, eh, uh, mm -hmm. you've had makeup on all day, a little psh, psh, and you're like, hello. Will it work for guys, too? Will it work Absolutely. for me? Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, yeah, when this is over, I'm going to spray you you're in the face. You're going to spray me? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I love it. Before we go to break. How about Perfect. that? Yeah. Um, now, you, you live this uh, organic lifestyle, too. Is, is it a full lifestyle, then, for you? It is. It is. It's something that, you know, once you learn about it, you sort of can't stop doing it. Mm -hmm. You know, in I'm lucky that I live in California where you know all our produce is readily available yeah. so it's easy to have farm to table food and you know I'm I'm just super green I guess mm -hmm. I drive a Prius and I have a water filtration system at home and I try to eliminate my use of plastic as much as yeah. possible and I sit on the board of the Environmental Media Association where we try to do a lot of good using the media um, yes, it's something I'm passionate about. You also do a lot of charitable work, mm -hmm. and uh, you've done some work in the Congo recently mm -hmm. too. Tell me about that and how moving that was for you. Wow. Well, it, there's twofold. That's a, it's a, you know, when I partnered with Mineral Fusion, they uh, they worked with the Coalition Against Domestic Violence. Mm -hmm. um, so you know, I kind of it's nice because we're doing something locally 
as well as globally. Mm -hmm. So before I worked with Mineral Fusion, for a number of years I did um, raise hope for Congo and I'm continuing to be a spokesperson where we raise awareness for the women and girls of the Congo. Because I don't know if you know this, but it's the most dangerous place in the world for a woman to exist. Mm -hmm. They use rape as a weapon of warfare. Mm -hmm. And it's all fueled over um, a mineral war that we use for our cell phones and our computers. It's tin, tank mm -hmm. uh, tantalum, tungsten, gold. Um, so we're trying to raise awareness, give a voice to the women and the girls, and to just have the, the companies to get conflict-free minerals and give peace a chance. Yeah, like and when you go there and hear their stories, it must be so moving just for your own life. It's too. crazy. I haven't been yet. I'm mm -hmm. planning a trip this year. Oh, good. Um, and but there's a documentary called The Greatest Silence, and it absolutely floored me. I mean, we're so lucky here. It's it's unfathomable their stories. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thanks so much for coming in. Thank you. Okay, let's take the cap off that. Oh uh, yeah, you well, ready? I, you know, I'm tired. All right. I've got three babies a at home. Psh, psh. Yeah. I've got twin, one and a half year olds. Oh, I can already feel more relaxed. <laughs> Manuel, thanks for coming Thank in. Thank you. We're taking yeah. a break here on City News at 5. Stay with us. Can I have more? Because I'm still stressed. <laughs> it smells, it smells good really too. good. It right? does smell good. Yeah. Tell you, you'll get oh, yeah. this for your wife. <laughs> this is great. Thank you. <laughs>